All right, so why are you cutting it? It's just time, man. It's time? Yeah. So uh, today's the seven year anniversary when I started it. So once we cut it, you want to just go straight to wave? Yeah, I got a picture of you. Okay. So this is like wavelength with like a low fade with the C cups. So he found me on YouTube and he sent me this email. Very well spoken young man. He actually has a YouTube channel he wanted me to plug in. I'm going to pop it up right here on the screen. And then we start chopping. So you guys are going to see what's under this, what's hiding under this. It was crazy. I really like to cut them one by one to show respect to the hair, to each lock. I feel like it's disrespectful to just grab a bunch and just start, you know? You you know, most people who cut off locks this long, they're gonna keep them. They don't want no half cut dreads, you know what I'm saying? Cut them off one by one. It takes a minute to do. And as you can see, he's rocking the high top locks. I know that's big in like the lock community. If you have high top or like a taper, taper locks, but he, he's rocking the high top lock. But he got a lot of hair. This is seven years, he said 2017 to the day. So we see it's basically like lots of layers of clumps of hair. This is pretty much where the hair kind of starts to dreadlock up. He has a lot of new growth. So you see how I'm kind of individually picking up each clump to try and carve it, carve it out of his head. So I thought that was it, but then I combed through it. I attempted to comb through it and it was stuck. So there's a, about three more layers we have to go through. 
So you see I'm kind of peeling it. So now I can easily comb through it. That's when I knew all the layers were cut through. So now we could take it down to the kind of length we want. I'm gonna start with a three guard. And we just dropped our new online community. It's an online interactive community slash academy. We help teach barbers how to cut hair better. We teach normal people how to cut hair. Um, we teach barbers how to make content. We teach barbers how to make 10K a month. So if you guys are interested in that, we're already at 120 plus members. Head down to the link below in the description. It's gonna say School of Barbering. Join us, join the community. So for his fade, I'm gonna keep the C cups. Obviously we're gonna kind of replicate the picture, but in my own, add my own spin to it. Got my Lakers trimmers. I just love how he trusted me. Like I thanked him, I thanked him. He was thanking me, but I'm like, man, thank you for trusting me. I've never cut his hair before. He doesn't know me from a can of paint, but it's amazing how someone can feel connected to you through a video. You know, they trust you from just watching videos, from watching pictures of your work. And he said he's been watching me, so I, I wanna give a big salute to my dog, Bishop Coleman. And what makes our online uh, community different is most, you know, barber communities or it's just one kind of like leader. We have three, so three, 
different sources of tutorials, you know, three different styles of cutting hair. Not to mention, we're going to be featuring many different people around the industry. Um, everything isn't just going to be in-house. I don't, I don't believe that's, that's not always good. You know, sometimes it's good to feature people, you know, it's kind of like music. Some of the best songs have features, you know? So I'm gonna retake his hair down right before I wash it. I notice his hairline's a little thin in the corners. This could have been from the locks, but it also could have just been genetics. I think his hairline naturally is a little bit more higher, just a little bit. I'm gonna add some foam to lay it down. And this process is just therapeutic. Even me, when I'm when I'm rewatching this footage, it's just it's beautiful. It's a process. It's art, poetry. No matter the texture, no matter the style, it's all poetry. So it may look like I'm starting high, but he hasn't gotten a cut. He said in a year, like a shape up. So that's one year of growth of on his hairline and one we laid it all down forward so a lot of that is overhang and then the top of his head hasn't been cut in seven years so it's been a minute so we have a lot of room to work with on this side the other side's a little bit more higher that's kind of what i was talking about earlier So I'm gonna just add a ghost line on this side, which is basically like an invisible line so that we don't push it back too far. And now I'm gonna add a little bit of enhancements just to kind of darken up the corners. A little bit of the C cup too. I'm using my Easy Blade shaving products. You could use my code, it's on the screen for 10% off. Check it out. Yo. Oh, <laughs> Damn. Yo, you did a really good job. And there you got it, folks. If you guys like this video, drop a comment down below. Appreciate you. Trust in me too. No problem. Dog. It's your boy four and I'm out. Peace.